back in Orange County, more housing options are coming to the area. The county breaking ground on a massive complex for seniors. Fox 35 Sydney Cameron shows us the plans. One, two, three. The turn of fresh dirt signifies a fresh start for Pine Hills. This is a community that um, is ripe for some rehabilitation and it begins with housing. And Today, Wendover Housing Partners in Orange County broke ground on a 27 million 120 unit affordable senior housing complex with amenities. A fitness center, a theater room, a computer room, activity room with kitchen, a library. Hawthorne Park will be the new anchor for redeveloping Pine Hills, says Orange County Mayor Jerry Demings. It will replace a portion of an underutilized shopping center on Silver Star Road. Rent will be between the mid 700s and high 800s. There will also be new stores and a Lynx bus station is being built. Just imagine instead of rundown buildings and no man's land, we're going to have a thriving town center. Mixed use, mixed income, a place that's safe, a place that's clean, where folks feel good about opening for business and raising their families. More than 150 people will be able to live at the complex. Move-in day is expected by the end of the year. Sydney Cameron, Fox 35 News. Another Florida school district already ruling out e-learning for next school year. We told you Pasco County Schools will opt out of online learning this fall, and now Manatee County Schools are following suit. The CDC also weighing in. It says data suggests that virtual learning might present more risks than in-person instruction related to mental and emotional health. Kids are not being successful and it, it, it's very problematic because this is going to impact their academic performance for years to come. So we really want to get kids back into to bricks and mortar classrooms before great teachers uh, where they can uh, where they can learn. Pasco County Superintendent also says he feels safer since more staff members are getting vaccinated. Next on Fox 35, we can see the light at the